I bet this air vent connects up with the main ventilation system. I'd rather sleep on the floor. The button flushes the toilet, you hope. This action benefits you not. With you go the hopes of all the Spill Mountain folk. A laser hacksaw. This should come in handy. Have your orders. Continue long range scanning of the rim wall base. Aye, Captain. This tour of duty. Seventeen years without one shore leave. Hey, stupid. How can we go on shore leave when no one's even supposed to know we're on this world? Didn't you know what the words clandestine operation meant when you signed up?
Dr. Tomko, the protectors have restabilized. Shall I continue the increased current level or drop back down to normal? Leave the current high for an hour and then take another reading. Dropping the current too soon would be disastrous. No, I can't say Teal was happy with my report. In fact, for a few moments, I actually feared for my life. Frankly, Dr. Tomko, this tree of life experiment is beginning to make me very nervous. I don't think we should continue our attempts to control the ghoul protectors. I agree, Dr. Felbert. Although, unless Teal says something first, I think we'd best keep quiet on that topic. Is it all right if I take my dinner break now, Dr. Tomko? Yes, Ralph. And if you see Dr. Filbert in the dining room, please tell him I'll join him in a minute. The scientists have all gone to dinner. Now's my chance. Every table has a body on it. This must be the computer that controls the life support system. Miranda, I'm glad to see you. <clears throat> A puppeteer. Where did you find him? We didn't know he was there. Miranda, we've got a stowaway. Oh dear. I feel a wave of mania ensuing. Don't you dare go catatonic on us. Tell me what happened at the arm base. We just barely got out of there alive. Why? And where is Lance of Truth? We couldn't get to her in all the chaos. Somehow, I managed to accidentally unleash the ghoul protectors. Ghoul protectors? Miranda, you did not free the ghoul protectors. I did. If you would only allow me to explain... Puppeteer, speak and keep it short. My name is Webster. I am an experimentalist. The Conservative Party conspired to strengthen its hold on the puppeteer government. Yeah, we know. We were the conspiracy. That plan exploded, quite literally, in their faces. The resulting political chaos on the fleet of worlds creates an auspicious occasion for an experimentalist uprising. I have come to the ring world to retrieve my hindmost. But what were you doing in the middle of Arm Central? I needed their risk-taking abilities. Teal promised his assistance in return for certain technological advancements. But his mental state was rapidly deteriorating, his obsession with the ghoul protectors. I manipulated the situation to make it appear that Miranda released the protectors. 
Then I hid aboard a hammerhead, knowing that someone would escape in it. We find ourselves in each other's company purely by coincidence." "So your fail safe system didn't work, then?" "I honestly don't know. If the bomb did go off, as planned, then the Arm Base and the Ghoo Protectors have been annihilated. In which case, you both owe me a debt of gratitude, not merely for facilitating your escape, but for the destruction of a vicious menace as well." "I don't know about gratitude, but I guess we'll let you live. For now." "Look, then, and see what I took from the heart of the Spill Mountain." "What is it?" "Well, I don't actually know, but...." "I know what it is. Why, this couldn't have worked out any better if I had manipulated the entire scenario myself." "Somehow, I'm not convinced you didn't." "We must get to the map room immediately. As a precaution, I will guide us through the flup tube system. It is safer." "I'll take a puppeteer's word on that." "Does this have anything to do with that stepping disk thing Teal kept raving about?" "Yes, it does. But I'll explain once we're on our way. Here is the flup tube recirculation map for this region of Ringworld." "How do we access the system?" "Enter the flup tube at the top of this Spill Mountain. We will descend until we reach the ocean floor. Then we fly to the floating city." "Lap belts on?" "Here we go."